Hello and welcome back to your own channel Indian Defense Analysis where we bring to you all the latest development happening in the defense sector. Back in February 2021, the Economic Times have reported that Tata Group has acquired IPR that is intellectual property rights for a German origin platform to make an indigenous military aircraft in India. Though the company did not disclose any design details, the aircraft is likely to be based on Grob G 180 SPN. This information was confirmed when Tata Group showcased a HAISR that is high altitude ISR platform during Defense Expo 2022 based on Grob G 180. The firm has also stated that Tata is proud to announce the ownership of the complete IPR of this aircraft. The German made jet never reached serial production due to the financial crisis. While there are no firm orders from Indian military for this aircraft, but TASL is confident that they will receive orders in the near future. Grob G180 is a high altitude, long endurance, low wing twin engine composite aircraft designed to land on both paved and unprepared surfaces like grass and gravel. The aircraft is powered by two Williams FJ44 3A turbofan engine, each generating thrust of 12.44 kN. The aircraft can carry 800 kg of payload or 10 personnel including one crew member. It has empty weight of 3,700 kg and maximum takeoff weight of 6,700 kg. The aircraft has an endurance of 6 to 7 hours with 1,500 kg of fuel. It has operational altitude greater than 40,000 feet. The aircraft has a range of 1,800 nautical miles or 3,333 kilometers. As per report, TASL is also modifying the aircraft to fit special payloads so that it can undertake a demonstration of surveillance capabilities. The platform can be configured with state-of-art sensor suites and communication equipment. The modular architecture of the system enables the integration of either configuration for safety and surveillance tasks or higher configuration for defense missions. As per Tata, the platform is specifically designed and developed for critical applications like wider area surveillance, beyond the horizon surveillance while remaining within own territory, persistent eye in the sky mission requirements with the best in class payloads like COMINT or LINT or radars and EOIR. The mission system enables the crew to conduct ground and maritime surveillance missions. The aircraft is capable of functioning as an advanced tactical observation system for day and night operations, including full digital recording for reliable post-mission analysis and debriefing. Now, as we have reported earlier, India is also working on intelligence, surveillance and targeting reconnaissance ISTAR system with United States through DTTI initiative. This system is based on Bombardier, which is a bigger platform than Grob G180. The proposal involves the sale of one I-Star aircraft by US to India and collaboration on development of sensors for the replication of similar capability in India. The plan is to develop five I-Star systems at an estimated cost of $3 billion. This was today's update. Please let us know your views on this in comment section. If you like the video, do not forget to like, share and subscribe. With this, I would like to say goodbye and Jai Hind. We'll soon back with more interesting and amazing development happening in the defense sector.